Now, what does Lucky Udu do? Lucky Udu is somebody that takes his time, go and look for celebrities or entertainers that have been forgotten, people that should be at the top of their game. But for some reason, they were cut short at some point, and now they are currently where they are not supposed to be. So he brings them, he interviews them, and gives them a second chance, because that's how I see it. He gives them a second chance at fame. But when I don't twist the team now, don't go say, hey, if Lucky Udu posts you, your own don't finish. Instead of you people to be learning from all those people when they interview, you are supposed to be learning from their mistakes so that you too you know go make that mistake. Maybe you know that position. I don't know how to twist the whole thing. Say if lucky you do post to your own, don't finish with that. It does not make sense and it's not fair to the guy, especially when he's putting in a lot of effort into that thing. Now, see recently now, after he posted uh, Tespianozi, they don't start to make a uh, donation to Tespianozi. After Tespianozi talking story, now they've contributed as much as um, 3.4 million. The guy don't get a better place to stay now. Now, let's go back. Who is, who is Tespianozi? There's pianos in one of the pioneers of skit making. Where go far back as when people see they use Java phone. When we see they use 2700, C2, X2, C3, Express Music, Symbian phone, N70, N71, E series, and all. And all those Blackberry Cov2, Cov3, Tor, Torch, and the rest. That now when their test pianosi starts. Now, test pianosi, based on how we start by now, it's not supposed to be at the top of the game. But for some reason, you know, they're at the top of the game. And he share his story. Say, I will mismanage funds. I will follow women. You know, I think see, a lot of people go learn from that. But instead, do not twist the whole thing. Do not twist the whole thing. The guy is seriously giving them a second chance at fame. It should be applauded instead of the way on the drum. It's not fair what you are doing to the what you guys are doing to that guy. I'll be very, very honest with you guys. See the other day now, in bring pink code back. Those guys were saying, Will it be your pink code? Oh? And in the case to your heart, baby girl, I want to enter inside. Oh. Something there, even me and the wonder where they did. Until I see them that day for a page. And I was surprised. I stayed and I watched it and I was like, damn, man. Damn, man. And I learned one or two from that thing. That I guess sometimes, you guess I learned from that particular video. I guess sometimes you say, if career don't choose you. No follow within the general public wants. Like those guys now, they did their peak. It was just for them to cool down and start writing more music. But they went back to school. Going to school is fine. But they just completely shut down. I went back to school. And that was how the career... <laughs> Do you understand? At the end of the day, I listen, nobody, everybody needs to go to school. Do you understand? So the guy, they really try. He should be applauded for it. No, don't twist the OT9, don't just deposit it, 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 it. He's giving them a second chance at fame. My own advice to Loki Udu is simple. I watch one of your interview for channels Abi where where they say you don't like what they are doing. You made a mistake by listening to them. Nigerians go depress you. Nigerians will depress you. If you don't listen to them, they will depress you. You better be careful so that <laughs> may not be you, another Loki Udu will go interview tomorrow. Say, how do many of you remember this Loki Udu? It was the one. Because if they depress you now, you go don't start to the feast which you they do the bad and you go come stop. And that person will come pick up that platform and you don't go be that. You better be careful so that you don't learn. And you might go and learn the hard way if you let them get into your head. For real. You are doing what is good. I watch your post and I cool down and I watch it and I understand how more. This guy, they try. They give them a second chance that thing. Shout out to you, my brother. I don't know you. You, know, you never talked before. But me, I will see one or two of your posts. My own advice is saying, don't let Nigerians enter your head. That's all I can say. Please, I love them. Play. That's my line. And my line, they Koko P, what are you doing in my room, man? Nigga, get the fuck out of my room, bro. What's your problem, man? Man, come on, get out. Go, go to Lagos, bro.